Hey, Harry Taylor here. I want to talk to you a little bit about the new Harry Taylor Design Series 305 wedges. This new wedge comes in five different loss, 52 through 60. Some of the things I want to talk about the club is the club head shape itself is, is, a, is a more traditional teardrop shape, which, which I think through all my years of competitive golf and all the great players I've played with and all the millions of balls I've hit myself, I have found that this design shape probably suits me the best for various type conditions I might find around the green as far as chipping, pitching, bunker play. Now, the, the one very concerning thing that I had to look at was how we're going to design the sole of this golf club. How we put the particular grind on it, how we have the bounce beveled into the sole, and there's just there's all kinds of details on the sole of this golf club because again you know, from, from those of you that are from the northern United States, the southern United States, when you're playing on softer conditions, firmer conditions, you have to come up with a sole that can travel well, well from state to state. And through people that are competitive players, you run it up against so many different conditions. So that is some of the thought that went into the design of the golf club. Now, as far as the material that we used, we did use a 303 stainless, which is a very soft, bendable stainless steel. Uh, one of the things that we wanted to do, of course, was to mill the face of the club perfectly flat, and then we, we milled the grooves into the face right up to USGA specifications. The shaft that we put in the club is by far the most used shaft on the PGA Tour and in golf in general is a true temper dynamic gold shaft. The grip is Golf Pride's Tour Velvet uh, rubber grip, which both these components are as, as good as you can really put into a golf club. These are the standard offerings in the Harry Taylor Design Wedge. I feel if you if you select the the stainless chrome finish versus the black satin chrome finish. I think you'll love either one of the finishes. They both frame the ball beautifully. And as far as a wedge that's easy to play off of various different lies and conditions, I think the Harry Taylor wedge is gonna be a great selection for you.